Hi guys! I hope everyone is doing super dandy today because for today's video, we are gonna be spending most of our time in my closet right here. To be honest, I haven't done a closet clean out in a while or even just like a clean to my closet, so. Today we're gonna do that. We're gonna actually go into my closet. We're gonna declutter a bit, get rid of some clothes, organize it a bit. I'll show you guys all my clothes in there. And then after we're done this closet, I actually do have one more closet. I actually have my shoe closet slash my coat closet, which I technically share with my husband, but it's mainly mine. Like it's all my coats and all my shoes. He just puts a couple in there. So um, we also need to get that one. <laughs> cleaned out too so we got a lot of work to do today i'm gonna get started on this one but before we do i want to say thank you so much to poshmark for sponsoring today's video i will be putting some of the stuff on my poshmark at the end but i will mention more about that later and how you guys can get a discount off it too that's it so come watch me clean so we're gonna start here on the ground because this is where I keep all of my denim shorts that I recently worn and I wanna wear again. I typically wear my denim shorts all the time, so I wanna wear them again before washing them, so instead of actually putting them away, I just put them on the ground. Some of you might think it's gross, but I think it's practicality or practical. I don't know, English is not my best language or it is my best language, I've just, not good at it. So I actually have a ton of vintage Levi shorts and I don't think I need like four pairs so I'm gonna get rid of these. Keep these, keep these. I love skorts, not getting rid of this. I love wearing skorts. I wish I could thrift more because I'm always looking for skorts at the thrift store but that is like one of the hardest thing, things you can thrift. See, another pair of vintage Levi shorts. I like these ones though, so I'm gonna keep these pair. Wow, I'm so, wow, more shorts. I was looking for these. Definitely not getting rid of you. I love these shorts. These are one of my favorite pairs of denim shorts and they're thrifted. Well, all my, all my stuff is thrifted to be honest. This top, I might need to start a maybe pile. I think I need to start a maybe pile. So I have like 500 pair of short overalls. I, I love wearing them in the summer. And I recently thrifted this pair, they're a Levi's pair, which I was so excited to find, but I think they're too short on me. I think they're too short on me. So I think I'm gonna have to give these to someone else. Like, look at that tag. Yep, we're just gonna have to say bye to them. Fun pants, which I'm gonna show you later because I ended up getting these on Poshmark. Got everything down on the floor, so now we can work our way up. So I just wanted to take a quick break from the decluttering because I wanted to talk about today's sponsor, which is Poshmark. If you haven't heard of Poshmark before, they are this amazing online store where you can shop from other people's closets and you can even sell on there yourself. Super easy to open up a closet on there. You can sell women's clothes, fashion, home decor, and even beauty. We all know that shopping secondhand is super sustainable. So if you have some clothes you're not wearing, it's a great idea to try Poshmark out and try to sell them on there so someone else could enjoy them. Poshmark is available in Canada, US, and Australia so if you're one of those countries you guys can download it for free and you guys can start making money by selling your clothes. Selling on Poshmark is super easy once you have an account all you have to do is take some photos add a little description set your price and then you can just list it. Also if you haven't had a Poshmark account before I have a coupon code for you guys if you guys want to get $15 off your first order use my coupon code Jenna Phipps shop which is also my closet name and you guys will get $15 off your first purchase. Also last also <laughs> don't forget to check out my closet where a ton of the items here that I'm getting rid of today will already be in my closet right now. But before we get back to the actual cleaning and the decluttering, I do have a mini thrift haul that I purchased on Poshmark. So let me show you. I ended up getting three items off Poshmark. So from the first seller, I ended up getting this shirt right here, which you might've seen me already wear in a thrift with me. It's this beautiful t-shirt. I love it. It's so comfy. And then the next item I got from the same seller were these checkered pants right here. They fit amazing. I love them. They're so nice. I have actually been looking for these exact pair for so long. So I'm so happy I was able to find them on Poshmark secondhand. Then the last item I got from a different seller was this cute smiley flower dress here. This is another dress I've been wearing nonstop since I purchased it. It is so perfect for summer, but I also got a nice outfit for fall so this is the next item I got and oh my goodness 
I'm so obsessed with everything I found on there. All of these clothes on the hanger here are supposed to be the clothes I wear the most. And a lot of them aren't. A lot of them have just been here collecting dust, me hoarding them because I think they're pretty, but realistically, I'm just not, I'm not wearing them. So I need to go through all of these and figure out which ones I'm actually wearing and which ones are just here to look pretty. I really like it because it said someone hand knit it, but um, I don't wear it as much, so I think I'm just gonna fold this one up and not keep it in my prime real estate. This one, it just doesn't fit me perfect. I love the color and it looks so good in my closet, I gotta admit, but they're just not being worn very much. I love this thrift flip I did, but I'm not really wearing brown right now, so I think I'll keep it just because I do like the shirt, but we'll, we'll just move it, we'll just fold it up. This one I'm keeping here, I just thrifted it, it's beautiful. This one reminds me of something my grandma would wear, and I dig it, but she's not being worn very much, so we'll just fold her up, I don't know, I don't want to get rid of her yet. I love you, and I wear this one actually a lot. Okay, this one, this shirt is beautiful, I love it, it looks amazing in my closet, but it's not one I really grab very often. I'm just gonna put it in my maybe pile. I think this one's a little too big for me, that's why I don't wear it. I really do like the top, but I'm not really into brown this second, so we'll just fold her up. Okay, this one's fancy. This one's real fancy, and it might be too fancy, that's why I don't really wear it. Not getting rid of this one, I love this one. I'm conflicted, do I keep you or do I not keep you? We'll think about it, we'll think about it. I'm really sad about this one because I thrifted her, it's a vintage garage dress, and I love her, she is so pretty, but her armpits are too tight for me for some reason. I don't know, maybe I'm too big, like maybe this is just too small for me in like this area, so I think we're gonna give her to someone else. Here's another one I'm really sad about. Look at this beach sweater. Do I keep you or do I get rid of you? Now for just a few of my overalls that are actually put back in the right spot. So I have this dress one right here and this other overall one right here. Oh, here's a pair too. Yep. Okay, so I think I'm gonna get rid of this pair just because this pair fits me better. So we're gonna get rid of this vintage pair of overalls. I have my actual one pair of long overalls that I love. Not getting rid of those. I'm thinking about getting rid of this top right here. Just because I do have a lot of tropical and this one, it's not one I gravitate to the most. I gravitate to the other ones a lot more, so. Bye. Also, do you guys watch me make this shirt? This is like my favorite shirt right now, so. I'm not getting rid of her. She's staying with me forever. So for these drawers right here, these are the drawers that, um, are supposed to have like pants and workout gear and things that are supposed to be organized but end up being just a space for me to throw my clothes at the end of the day when I go into my pajamas without having to like actually put them back so it's kind of messy it's kind of messy so I'm gonna go through everything see what is here because um it's supposed to be here or here because I'm lazy and don't know where to put it look how pretty this pattern is look at this skirt I love it but <laughs> It's slightly too big and I'm kind of lazy to alter it so I think I'll just give it to one of you guys. So I thrifted this denim skirt here, this Levi's one, and I love it but I just don't get around to wearing denim skirts. I just prefer shorts so maybe one of you guys can enjoy it because it's, it's really cool. Mm, okay, bye. This drawer is supposed to be my extended pile of fun pants, but as you can see, I got a little lazy and there's like workout gear in here. And a few fun pants, you know, some things are actually in their place, just not many. So these pants, are you kidding me? I'm never getting rid of them. Never, never, never. These pants, maybe I'll get rid of these ones because I ended up making a pair that actually I think I like a little bit more, so we'll get rid of these. I don't need two pairs of zebra pants. My skirt! Yeah, I love this skirt. I thrifted this skirt. The only thing is it's very wrinkly, but I still wear it wrinkly. Like, it's not stopping me. Does anybody remember me wearing this in my first YouTube video ever? Has anybody even watched that? I, I don't encourage you to go watch my first YouTube video ever. It's probably really, really bad, but... This one I just can't get rid of just because it has so much nostalgia to it, being that I wore this in my first thrift with me ever, and it just reminds me of a year and a half year old, no, 
a year and a half ago, Jenna. My athletic stuff here is folded so nicely because I just like never wear it. <laughs> this skirt. I'm pretty sure last time I did my closet clean out, I said I was just gonna alter this skirt because it's so pretty and beautiful. And I was like, I'll just make it fit me. But I don't know, do I wanna do that or do I just wanna get rid of it and let one of you guys enjoy it? I don't know, this one's too bit decided. I love this root sweater. It's actually a vintage sweater I thrifted, but Benson's hair gets all over it. It's dark green. I can't wear dark green. I need a, you know, a lighter color, so. Bye. So we're back on the ground again because I wanted to show you guys all of my fun pants here. If you guys have followed me for a while, you guys know I love fun pants and I have a whole whole row of them here. I'm gonna show you guys what I have. I have this swirly pant here, this, this love one, a blue psychedelic pair, a ton of glittery ones that I made, this one, which I got off Depop. I got checkers here, more checkers, my zebra pair that I made, some gingham, and lastly, another pair of zebra, because why not? I'm gonna keep all those, so sorry if you guys were hoping I was gonna get rid of some. I'm getting rid of like two maybe, or there's a few, there's a few here, but these ones are, you know, no, I'm not giving these up. This dress, which I really do love this. I bought this from a vintage shop, but I just like haven't really worn it, so maybe one of you guys can wear it. My favorite top! Gosh, this feels like a treasure hunt going through my closet. This top is a really cute swim top that I got from Value Village and I wear it as a normal top. You probably have seen it on my Instagram because, or in my videos because I wear it all of the time. Not get rid of you. Okay, this shirt is so cute and I used to wear it all the time when I was obsessed with just like neutral brown colors and just oranges. Like, look at this. It's a PEI dirt shirt and has this beautiful little sunflower on it, but I haven't worn it at all this summer, so I think Maybe one of you guys can enjoy it. I totally forgot I had this shirt. This one has been hiding from me. I really like this one. I don't know if you guys have seen this because I thrifted this so long ago, but last year, I think, um, yeah, almost a year ago, I was thrifting and I found this authentic off-white shirt. Isn't this so cool? It was like brand new too. It even has like the little, you know, the string that comes with it. The Simpson one, which is just something that I'm just gonna hoard and keep because it's like one of my best thrift times ever. So I'm just gonna keep her back here. So I think I'm actually done in my closet, which that was actually pretty quick. So I think it's time to go to the other closet. Which I don't want to do. I don't want to do. There was a big spider in there last time, so I really, I actually like really don't want to go in there. This is way better than lighting here, but here is my front door, and then right beside my front door here, I have this closet, which has, oh, you can't, wow, that was a terrible reveal. You guys can't even see it. Here's the closet. You can see there's, there's a lot of coats in here, and it's pretty big, like I want to say it's like five feet wide or maybe like a meter and a half if you, you do metrics. So there's a decent amount of coats in here and I gotta say I probably wear three of them, maybe four, not really sure, but not very many. So we gotta, we gotta get rid of some of them. Let's start way down here. This one's just kind of boring. It's just a winter coat that I've had probably for like 10 years. Oh my gosh, it's dusty. And since then I bought another winter coat, so we'll get rid of her. She was, you know, my main gal in college. I don't think I've ever shown you guys this. Wow, there's a lot of Benson hair on this. But this is my varsity jacket from college because we, as an athlete, we got one of these if you made it to a conference. Yeah, a conference. So I made it to conference and then they gave me this jacket after. It even has my name in there. Like, look at that. So cool. I never wear it, but it's cool. Why do I have a trench coat and I know I'm never gonna wear it? Here's a thrift flip I did, which I haven't worn in a while, but it's also really cool. I remade Hailey Bieber's jacket a long time ago and I'm just gonna make a maybe pile over here. I think we finally have to get rid of this one. This is screaming old Jana. Jana, that, that sounded weird. See, I actually really like this one because my dad actually has the exact same one and he wore it all the time growing up. So then when I found one of these in my size, I got it. So we're gonna keep him, her, eh, we'll call it my him. This one's a really nice denim jacket. I thrifted it. I remember where I thrifted it. I got this at Value Village and it's a vintage one. It does have Nevada here, which is the brand it is. And it's such a beautiful wash. Like she is beautiful. It's like so nicely worn too. 
We'll put you in navy. Green blazer or green leather jacket. I don't know. This one, not feeling you anymore. Okay, this one's really cool. Look how pretty this one is. Even has like these pretty little cuffs. It's white, it's not black, so Benson's hair doesn't destroy it. Look at this tie-dye one I have. It's a Levi's tie-dye jacket. And I also have a long Levi's denim jacket. Like I told you guys, I have a lot of denim jackets. There's Tim's jacket in here. I didn't even think he had anything in here. Okay, it's tightly fine. Fine. <laughs> ah. It's time we finally do shoes now. These shoes are so cool. Look at these boots. Why haven't I worn you? You're brand new. I think we might have to say goodbye to you because I already have a black pair of boots. So I've been wearing these shoes for a while, but they're too small. Like they're actually one size too small. Like my toes are at the end. So I think I actually just have to like get rid of them before I like wreck my feet. That's actually it for shoes. I have really fat feet, so shoes just never fit me. So I just don't really have many shoes. So now we have to do, or I have to do, my least favorite part, which is folding all of the clean laundry right here. I would have my husband help me with this, but he does it really badly, so I don't ask for his help anymore, because last time I asked for his help, he folded all of my clothes inside out, and when he was putting the socks together, none of them were matching. He mix matched all of my socks, so when I actually went to go get them and wear them, I would have two different socks and I, I prefer to wear two of the same socks, especially going through all that effort of actually like folding them. So I just do it by myself now, which is not that big of a deal because most of the clothes are mine anyways. But that being said, I gotta fold all of these so I can put them into the closet so I have enough room in there and also make sure that there's a little bit of empty space so when I get new clothes, I have space for it. And then also I'm gonna go through it all again to make sure that everything in there is something that I actually love. Enjoy this little time lapse of me folding all these clothes. Yay. So my final step is I'm gonna go through these once more and I wanna color coat them. I don't know, I just find it so satisfying when you have things color coded in your closet. And I'm also gonna switch out because some of these hangers, they're, they're different heights and that really bothers me. So I'm gonna put all the taller ones on this side and the shorter ones on this side. And then hopefully at the end, I have a ton of spares. So when I get new clothes, I can just hang them up. This is why I go through my closet one more time because now all the maybes I had, I can finalize it. So yeah, I'm gonna get rid of this one. I love this shirt, not getting rid of this one. Another one I thrifted or pretty much everything in my closet thrifted. I would say 99%, you know, or 98%, everything in my closet is thrifted, pretty much everything. Like it's hard to find an item in here that's not thrifted. Like I have a few fun pants that I bought in brand new, but for tops, I really, yeah, none of this is brand new. Look how pretty that looks. I didn't organize this side because um, I don't really care because it's just like my sweaters and a few dresses, but this side, wow. Well, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed decluttering my closet today, cleaning it, getting it all organized, uh, organizing it. <laughs> it was it was really not that, that fun, to be honest. Usually I say, oh my gosh, that was so fun, but it wasn't that fun, but I do admit, it looks really good after and it's very satisfying so I'm very happy I did it so thank you once again to Poshmark for sponsoring today's video if you guys want to shop any of the clothes that I got rid of in today's video it'll be all linked down below in the description and if you haven't got a Poshmark account before you guys can use my coupon code Jenna Phipps shop and you guys can get $15 off your first order
But that's it, so be sure to check out my closet on Poshmark if you guys want to buy anything for all you Canadians. And if you guys are not in Canada and you still want to shop on Poshmark, be sure to check it out. They are available in the United States, Canada, and Australia. That's all I had to say, so I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!